Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to configure SACM reporting. So what I need to do is configure the reporting service by going to SQLs. I'm looking for reporting services configuration manager. It is click next or connect. Make sure um, everything is correct here. Service account. I can use the built in account or I can use the domain account. I'm just going to use the built-in account. It's okay. Web service URL. That looks fine. The database. That's my database. So this is it's kind of configured by the installation of um, SQL servers already. This is reportings. So everything looks good. I'm just going to minimize this and install the reporting role. Go to administration under sites, right click on the server, add site system roles. Click next. Next, I'm going to choose reporting service point. Click next, verify. I'm going to use the existing account. Everything looks good. Check out. I'm going to click next. Next, all green, I mean, is good so far. It's going to take a while um, for the reporting points to be installed. I'm going to pause the video. I'm sorry, I'm going to pause the recording. All right, I'm back. Let's refresh. Oops. Yep, there it is, all the reports. Let's go to the web to see if I can access it from the web. I think the... Um, let's go to... So to access from the um, the web, you just have to do is go in, enter your the uh, reporting service point, and then reports. Oops, where is it? I guess my account don't have access. Okay, so that's how you access it, but I'll fix my account later. Um, okay, so that's how you configure the SCCM reporting service. Thank you for watching and have a good day.